I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America, and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. And now for the Texas Pledge. Honor the Texas flag. I pledge allegiance to the Texas, one state, under God, one and indivisible. Please remain standing for a moment of silence. Welcome to this morning's edition of Aero News. Today's Friday, January 7th, 2022. To get things started, here's Time Rewind. It's Time Rewind for January 7th. In 1789, George Washington emerges as the winner of the first presidential election. 210 years later, in 1999, the impeachment trial of President Bill Clinton begins in the Senate. Touting itself as a different kind of company, Saturn enters the car business in 1985. It's established as a subsidiary of General Motors, promising consumers affordable, quality cars with no-haggle showrooms. Everybody, this is Julie, and this is her first new car. Christmas is over, but on this day in 1950, what's now considered a holiday classic is the number one single. Rudolph the red Reindeer. That version by Gene Autry holds the dubious distinction of being the first single to completely drop off the chart after reaching number one. Madonna rules the pop chart in 1985. Learn more about what happened on this day at time-rewind.com. I'm David Mendel. On the national calendar, it's National Bobblehead Day. For this Feel Good Friday, let's talk about how good spreads. Wait, oh, they smell like America. Today's episode is about giving back and about how good can spread. I'm gonna need a bigger bag. Got too much good to give. You're not one of those people who say the world can't be changed. You, you believe that it's everybody's duty to give the world a reason to dance, right? We have a whole world to make more awesome. People, we need you. We really need you. Kids, people used to be kids, everybody. But how, Key President? Everything's terrible. Hey, quiet you. I know, sometimes things can look pretty dark, but there's always light. Light is always still there. In fact, let me show you how good spreads. Yeah, this is my baby right here. Okay, I, I need you guys to listen up. This is How Good Spreads. Let's read. How does good spread? Can we make the world brighter? Can we together make somebody's load lighter? Some people think good only spreads if you have lots of money. Or a nonprofit who makes a cool video. That's slick and really funny. Meow. Burp. Does good only spread when you have the right hashtag, or the right bracelet, or t-shirt, or give out free tote bags? Does good happen by accident, just out of the blue? Does good only spread when Beyonce allows it to? Queen Bee? She's pretty powerful, but wow, 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 so are you. The world's only seen a glimpse of what you can do. Your heart is so big, but you might feel so small. I'm telling you now, you're thinking as a flaw. <laughs> good spreads when good is spread. And that's totally how you live. You share and you love, and you give and give and give. If someone needs lifting, you send them a rope. Your little whispers of love sends out huge gusts of hope. I know what you're thinking. That's a nice little story you're reading, Kid President. But what about me? You wanna know how you can make good things spread in the world? Show up. Show up in the world, you'll be a light. You'll see work to be done on your left and your right. Like Caitlin, a girl who met people in need and started putting inspiring words on dusty old keys. Now she gives people jobs and second chances. She's filling the world with more and more dances. Or Ricky, a funny guy who wanted to share random acts of kindness everywhere. Communities are changing in Cleveland and tons of other places because Ricky just wanted to put smiles on folks' faces. I mean, there's other things too. Ever heard of Socktober? Well, Brad, the guy behind the camera here. Well, before we started all this cute president stuff, he started in Socktober. He was just a guy who wanted to make a difference. He was just a sad, pale man. Hey, come on. I'm sorry, I can't. it's just the truth. Well, anyway, he heard socks were one of the most needed but least donated items in homeless shelters. Right when they're preparing in the winter months, there are over 600,000 men and women who are homeless in the United States. 
and some of them were children. He started telling some friends, and then they started telling some friends, and telling schools, and telling churches, and then the next year, grew even bigger. We started this little kid president project, and I invited some people to help out. October! And you totally have. So October drives have happened all over the United States, in every single state, and on every single continent. That's the whole world, y'all. There's just a need. There's good to be done, and we're inviting people to do it. I guess that's just how good spreads. So how will you show up? How will you make things brighter? By loving the people next to you. And making your loads lighter. Anger is contagious. Hate and fear, they are too. But I'm not here to spread those. <laughs> and neither are you. We're here to spread hope and make the world dance. Open your eyes and your heart and we might stand a chance. Get out of your comfort zone and get out of your head. Get to loving people and good can't help but be spread. Oh, don't know about y'all, but I'm ready. Ready to dance. Ooh, mail. Thank you. Dear Cube Prison, I sent you a letter in your last video. Why didn't you answer in this one? Your voice is changing. Are you gonna be Cube President forever? Oh, uh. ah. <laughs> I'll answer that next video. It's October. I want to say a special word of thanks to Glad to Give. <laughs> this October is going to be the best yet. And it's thanks to people like you and also the awesome brands like Glad. Glad to Give. They're pinching in and making incredible stuff happen. Check out this bag, y'all. I'm filling up this bag with as many socks as I can. That bag can help my neighbors who are homeless. America socks. I love America socks. Everyone's pitching in, and that makes good spread. Now, if you excuse me, I got some socks to collect and some bags to fill. I'm out. Here's your random fact of the day. Apple pie isn't actually American. On the lunch menu today, the cafeteria is serving chicken tenders, cheese pizza, pepperoni pizza, cheeseburgers, chicken smackers, and buffalo chicken smackers. The district science fair is January 14th. This week, students should submit all their finalized materials. Students must have their ID badges around their necks before entering the building. If students forget their ID, they can get a temporary one at the front office. The charge is $1 per day. Students that do not have the money will be charged. Students that need a new badge can purchase one for $5. As a reminder, doors open at 7 a.m. Breakfast is available until 7.25 a.m. The tardy bell at 7.30 a.m. The school day ends at 3.10 p.m. The early dismissal days end at 11.15 a.m. The SAT word of the day is hubris, which means excessive pride. Galveston weather. Am I supposed to be going? Go. Did you? Yes, I clicked it. Oh, I thought you. On the national calendar today, it's National Pearl Harbor. <laughs> Wednesday the 15th, it's time to get cozy and wear your school appropriate pajamas or co- Sorry. Welcome to today's edition of Arrow News. It's Thursday, December 12th. 12th. Aaron! That was not Aaron. Wait, was it? About 9 million people suffer from seasonal affective disorder. A lack of sunlight can usher some of us into a temporarily <laughs> depressive state. <laughs> Corbin! <laughs> For this Feel Good Friday, the theme is giving. The holiday season is about spending time with loved ones. Loved ones. Loved ones? Loved ones. It's supposed to be loved ones, right? It is loved ones, but I'm saying loved ones. For this Feel Good Friday, the theme is giving. The holiday season is about spending time with... Why do I mix up timed and love? Just keep going. Keep going. 
Here's your random fact of the day. Dead skin cells are a main... Corbin! They're amazing. What am I doing? Just keep going. Keep going. Don't do anything to my Chromebook, please. Uh, here's your random fact of the day. Dead skin... <laughs> On the lunch menu today, the cafeteria is serving build your own sub sandwiches, cheese pizza, pepperoni pizza, cheeseburgers, and... Ah. Thank you very much for watching this morning's edition of Era News. Good luck to those participating in the robotics tournament this weekend. Have a great day.